that I should have been on. Whoa. Dang. It was so good. Bit of sad. Oh, it was an accident. I love a box, but <laughs> oh, I need a PT. Mm. <gasps> no self discipline, no willpower, nothing. No, oh, no. Morning. There is a little hint, a little hint of a blue sky. My tan is done. My old flex is ready to be washed off. It's a new week. Right. I would like to do a Valentine's look today in my new room. And yeah, I don't know what else. Was there something? Oh yeah, I wanted to talk about the whole Michaela mascara thing. Not to like dob her in or anything. I just think it's going too far now. Everyone's jumping on freaking bandwagon, aren't they? Look, she shouldn't have done it, of course, but imagine having millions of people on you like this. She must feel like shit. It is very deep to lie about a... Uh... I'm sorry, Dave. It's bad to lie about a product that you are promoting, but at the end of the day, if you think about it, it's just fucking mascara. It's just fucking mascara. I wouldn't have done it. I'd never do it. But I just think everyone should just leave it alone now. People are using it to, like, further themselves. You know, creating TikToks about it. Mm. I just think leave the girl alone. Leave the girl alone. Leave the girl alone. Oi, can you see this my brow right now? I don't know if you can see what I can see in this zoom mirror. Whoa. She's coming along. Okay. Charity shop. Vintage parcels. Amazon parcels. Is that it? Is that all we got to do? We've got a lot though. We have got a lot. This car is very heavy right now. That was a complete mission. That was a crazy mission. Bloody hell. Do you know most charity shops are shot on Sunday, on Monday? So I originally, I ended up taking it to the one I went to originally, just parking a bit further away, but God, I had so many bags and they were so heavy and I was walking down the street like some camel with all these bloody bags. I looked to right day, but I had to do three trips, but got the stuff to the charity shop, shop, sent all the parcels, returned parcels. Fuck me. Picked up my shoes that my friend borrowed. Yeah, hold on, thank God, we can go home. I'm having a bacon sandwich to reward myself. I was just about to start a Valentine's look. I was gonna do um, like a lot of doll beauty, because I, doll beauty, why don't I say the T? Doll, I was gonna do a lot of doll beauty, like a mainly doll beauty look, because I've accumulated a lot of doll beauty makeup over the past, God knows when. Then I realised, I opened my bloody cupboard and I saw these rollers I bought the other day because I was supposed to do an Electra heart makeup look. I think I'm going to have to do that because it makes sense. I've just washed my hair, so I don't want to wave my hair and then have to put curlers in my hair for this look tomorrow. So, plans changed. We're doing an Electra heart look. Oh, Does anyone else love, just love Marina and the Diamonds? I just love her so I feel so lucky that I went to, because I hate myself, I hate myself forever, forever for not going to the Born This Way Ball. Oh God, I actually cursed myself for that. My mum literally said to me, she went, I was talking about it, I don't know how old I was, I was like, oh, Born This Way Ball, tickets coming out soon, and she was like, oh, do you want to go? And I did that thing, you know, where you're like, oh no, no, it's okay, I didn't want her to like, Spend the money on me, blah blah blah, and then she just didn't bring it up again. <laughs> so I never went. Oh god, and that was the best Lady Gaga era ever, ever, and I missed that. I did go to the art pop ball though with my, what's it called? The ball. I went to the art pop tour with uh, my dad though. That was funny. <laughs> But yeah, I'm just so glad that I managed to go to 
uh, Mourinho's tour when she was in a Electra Heart era because that was just such an era. Such an era. My God. I'd love to go again. Oh, and I also saw Miley Cyrus in a Bangers era. Once again, the best era for me. I'd love to see her now as well. Oh, right, I need to do the makeup. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's half ten, but I'm done. That took way longer than it should have. But I filmed literally. I, well, I don't know why I do it. Well, I do know why I do it actually, because I do it for, well, tell my social media. But I was filming, I think, 11 videos at the same time there. Not like the same time, but 11 TikToks I had on the go. Whilst I was doing each one. So obviously, this isn't. This isn't a difficult look but jesus christ it's okay it's really hard to get in as well i didn't think they'd be that difficult to get in but they were oh but i'm done now well i need to get a picture then i need to film a reveal in the bath and then i can go to jake's christ thankfully he's busy as well so it doesn't really matter oh i'm pissed off obviously we've both been busy jake's been busy doing his thing i've been doing my, busy doing my thing but i'm done now and it is late, it's midnight. But I wanted to go and see Jem. Cinemies being on nights. And everyone's parked behind me, so I'm blocked in. And then Jack, Jake can't pick me up because he's had a drink. <sighs> I don't want to stay in this stinky house. So I've had a spray of perfume to make myself feel better. But I don't feel better. Better or better. So bad. Can I teach myself elocution? Elocution? Or should I just say stay a stinky northerner that can't speak? It's part of my personality, I suppose. Spurs. Oh my god. You're having a you're having a laugh. You're having a fucking laugh. I've just gone to sit in bed, eat my crisp, and carry on watching glow up. They've taken the season off. So I'm not going insane. That's one, two, three. Yeah, they've only got three seasons on there for some reason. Why would they take another one off? Obviously, they've got one brewing in the works at the minute that I should have been on. Whoa. But what's going on? What's going on? Why would they do that? Why would they do that? I was literally on the third episode. Why would they do that? <sighs> New Alina Day. Oh, my God. Good morning. I was having a right good snooze, I was. Uh, well, actually, my dad was clashing pants together at seven in the morning, so I went and shouted at him for that. And we couldn't get back to sleep for a bit, and then it was just bliss. I was asleep. It's half ten. But then I got up because Jake texted me, and I thought we were supposed to be going to the traffic centre. And then Zoe, my manager, messaged me. She was like, um, you ready for today? And I was like, shit, I completely forgot. I'm supposed to be going for a uh, meal with Zoe and Jess today. How could I forget that? I'm such an it's such a good job she said because I would have still been in bed and it's at two. So I better get up very soon. I'm gonna post my TikToks. Uh, sorry, Jake, I booked, double booked him as well. <laughs> and then I said, it's fine, we can just do it tomorrow. And I was like, oh, I'm busy tomorrow. <laughs> I'm sorry. But I've moved tomorrow. I was just going shopping with my mum. So I'm just gonna post my TikToks and then we're gonna get up and I'm gonna get ready in a whiz. Right, I'm ready. I'm wearing this new top from Matter Complex. It's felt like this. Oh, here's 20% off your next purchase. There you go, everyone. Just thank you, 2021. It's just been 2022, hasn't it? Or is it 2022 now? I don't even know. It's sick. So cute. She made it for me and then it's got this little thingy there. I love that. Um, yeah. Dead cool. Okay, we're going to tattoo. I feel like I already told you that, did I? I don't know, but I fucking love tattoo. And I'm pretty hungry now, so buzzing. I'm actually early on time for once as well. I'm like 15 minutes early. Park my car on the first level of the car park. That's impressive stuff. There's some guy in. Just as I got out of the car park, he winds his window down. He's got like dad sunglasses on and he's like, Gorgeous. Oh, fuck off, you're hanging. Whoa, look at this plate. Stunning. Oh my god, is it a push? Oh my god, it's, it's a pull. I just love it in here. It smells so fucking good. They've just lit some incense and I feel like I'm in Bali.
jasmine rice. Thank you. Surprise encounter. <laughs> I'm not too nervous. I look like a floppy dog. I've been teaching today. How long have I not seen you for? Six months. It's been quite a while, but it's not amazing. need the light, I left it in my car. We do not need the light. Wow, that's good. It's a massive difference. It smells nice. I know. And I've got that. Get away from it. That's the starch. Yeah, Crystal Noir. I've got that. That is one of my favourites. That was nice. We had a surprise visit from Lucy as well because she was having a meeting with um, Jess. So I had a meeting with Jess and Zoe. Uh, that is so good. Oh, the food is so good. If you're not being an in go, like, I already knew it was good, but it is so good. I ended up taking everyone's leftovers home. <laughs> Never take big fat Jenna to a meal. But I can finally go and see Jake now. But do you know what makes me sick? Do you know what makes me sick to my stomach? Jake always had an Android and then last year I kind of persuaded him a little bit whilst he was in the phone shop to get an iPhone. It was beautiful, it was a beautiful year. And he's just got rid of it today and gone back to an Android. Who does that? You have to be sick in the head. I, I'm a bit worried. Anyway, so that means we're going to have to go back to messaging on something like Facebook. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Not me sick. Anyway, other than that, I'm actually very excited to go and see him. So, I drive home now in traffic. Big old rush hour traffic. And maybe I'll see him in like an hour. It's like six o'clock. What time is it? It's late. Don't copyright me. Don't copyright me. Don't copyright me. It's just my favorite film. Don't copyright me. <laughs> anyway, Molly May's baby name. Oh, I really like it. I think it's really cute. I think it's sweet. Uh, I really like it. I think it's a nice name for a girl. Bambi. Bambi. Or oh, even maybe a boy. I love weird names. But um, I think... I, I don't think I would call it much. Oh, no. I, I kind of would like to. Not now, obviously. I wouldn't copy hers. But I just also wouldn't just want to think of the dear all the time because I fucking hate that Disney film it's too sad no actually I don't I don't think you would if once it was your child's name you'd just think of your child wouldn't you yeah it's funny actually because I was named after a Disney character a dog so but mine wasn't a popular one so you wouldn't think Jenna the dog off Balto the Disney film you'd just think Jenna the big fat one <laughs> anyway what do I need to do today? I've actually just got out of the shower. I'm not still in bed. I'm just so cold. And I needed to edit my vlog and upload it. So I thought I'll get in with the heated blanket whilst I do that. But now I need to get up. I need to take my laptop to the repair shop. Ugh, I've got boring jobs to do today. I am such an adult. Just ordered my sheet of glass for my um, table that's absolutely decked in. I'm going to stick stickers on. It's going to look so graceful. <laughs> I've just realised as well, it's February 1st. Crazy how fast time goes. Right, I've got to go all the way to bloody Manchester now for this laptop to get it fixed. I can't be arsed. Did I tell you what happened with it? Jake opened Oh, I did dinner. Yeah, I did. It just wouldn't turn on. And then Jake said, oh, I'll have a look at it. And then he opened it up. Um, and as he was opening it, he scratched the battery with a screwdriver by accident. And then he said it wouldn't be, I think it's right, it wouldn't be safe to keep it in there. So he binned that battery. Yeah, I didn't tell you this. And then he ordered a new one to put in it and it's just not come because every, a port delivering, but it's been like two, longer than two weeks. So I just thought, Do you know what? I can't be asked. Just going and getting it fixed at the proper laptop shop, whatever. I'm not waiting any longer. There's stuff I need to do on there. There's videos on there. There's just stuff. I need to edit. So the first guy said it would be £175 just for the battery. When the one that Jay got was 70 And then the next shop I went to he said it would be 150 But he said that it should work without a battery in it. I don't understand this shit. But then it's difficult because Jake's the one who's broke the battery. So Jake has to pay for it. So I can't obviously go and get it done for 200 quid. If he's saying that he can have it, he can buy one for 
70, I just can't be arsed. I just want my laptop back. It's not fair. I fucking looked after that laptop so much. And then Jake fucking broke the battery. And then now I've just got no laptop. No. No. Right. I'm going to tidy my room. I have got a Sophia Intensity vlog on, which I um, haven't watched for ages, ages actually. And I love them. I love them. I prefer them to the podcast. I just, I love the vlogs. I don't know why I stopped listening. I don't know. Um, I've just spotted this as well. Don't mind the chocolate wrappers on the floor. Wow, I'm literally Big Fat Jenna. Like, that is so scruffy. No, I've just, I've just knocked them off by accident. I've got a hole in my doll's kill socks. And I must say, like, I do not have holes in my socks. But I looked down, I felt it appear today. And I was like, do you know what? That's an ick. That is an ick. People with holes in their socks. Specifically boys, but I suppose girls too. That is an ick. These are going straight in the bin. Straight in the bin! Just not a morning person. No. It's not even morning, it's like half nine. I just can't do this. I'm going shopping today with my mum. Uh, she wants to go to Cheshire Oaks because she wants... She's been looking for a new plate set. I know this is very interesting, riveting content, but yeah. I actually don't really like Cheshire Oaks. It's a bit of like, it's just like cast offs in it. Mm. Hey. Here we go. I haven't been in there in ages actually. These are so nice. They're only 60 quid. Mm, down from 150. These were my original ones actually that I used to wear for Aldi in black. Yeah, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't wear that clothes. They're all right for you. Yeah, I like wacky shit though, don't I? This is really cute. It's just a little, teeny little crop top. It looks like it would be really nice quality. Well, I should hope so for Levi's. It's only £21. Pound. This would be nice for Jake. It's so cute. They are cute, but they're still £83. Wow, what a range. Two different shades of yellow oak. I wonder how well they sell. They're so cute slippers. The kids sizes and they're only actually 36. Oh Mr. God, she wants to cop some now. Get this. You can have them on. Oh here we are, this is what we came for. Brilliant play selection. It's fantastic already. She's very excited. Is it good? We've got a sample of this salty caramel hot mm, chocolate for us. Is it really nice? Yeah. It really smells nice. amazing. I just absolutely get it. Oh my god, that is so good. There was a raspberry one as well. Raspberry ripple. Can have dinner. Oh my god. I almost want to go back. That's good salesmanship, that. Mmm. Oh, it's so nice. As you can see, I've gotten very, very desperate for a um, belly bottom piercing. Our favourite, innit? Oh, we need more of that though. Oh, it looks evil. Is that a lot less monster style? I've seen so. Oh. I've seen so many things that I want to. Why is it keep it? Why? Blurry bastard. So many things that I want today. I'm just. I'm going the full length round, and then if I want them that much, I can go back for it. Mm. I really want them more slippers. I don't like my slippers, but they are a bit crap. Like I drag my feet along the floor because they don't actually stay on my feet. But you know what? Oh, the slippers are like they're only like thirty odd quid as well. How could you not? And I could wear them. Um, could I wear them out of the house? Or I don't know. I think they need a platform for you to wear them out of the house, don't you? Don't they? You no, know I'm like, don't oh, wear anything. It's a bit big for you, that. Yeah. It's alright. It smells nice. I think this is the worst I've ever been defeated. Mama, mama pigs eating all hers, aren't you? <laughs> I did have a slice of hers. Look at these tops. There's your dogs to Cheshire Oaks and we didn't know and now we feel really bad. We feel really bad, don't we? It's sad. It's sad. Oh my God, I just nearly had a fit. Look at this. I just went to grab this Converse. I thought this looks a nice colour. Peculiar, peculiarly shiny. Just keep coming. It's like a fucking baguette. Wow. That's bigger than my arm. It's a size 16. Look at this next to my head. So there's these ones with the platform. These are 40. 
But then, oh, mum's got some on now. Your girl, oh, socks, loving them. Um, and then there's these ones, which are the kids' ones, which actually fit better for some reason. And these are, they're only four pound less. They are probably a bit of a better colour though, those. Those, they look a bit more vibrant. I don't know I'm stuck. These are a UK five, and my foot's like hanging off the edge. I think there's just too much fluff in there, but there's not another size in these. Oh, she's back again. No, she's just topped us up. <laughs> too good. She said it was salted caramel, mum. It's salted caramel. All right. Salted caramel there. It's pretty bloody good, guy. Pretty good. Oh look, we found Rosie. <laughs> oh, it was an accident. Oh yeah, see, she's got her sequin Uggs on. She's going for it. She's going fast, isn't she? Whoa. Go on, the girl. Go on, girl. Let's go. The preemptive early warning alarm system. Well, I had a quite a nice day. I feel a bit bad because mum didn't buy anything and I bought those. She just didn't see anything she wanted. But sorry, sorry, you were. Uh, I will show you what I got. But first, I want to put these leds around my mirror let's get out of the way which is good timing actually because these these don't even work anymore and i can't find the ball for that so they're actually officially annoying me it is half 11 but we've got the tumble dryer on so hopefully my bed sheets will be clean for tonight well not clean dry okay guys are we ready that didn't take too long here we go to be honest i was hoping it was going to be more of like not like staggered light i was hoping it was just going to be a ring of light around but it looks kind of cute now the more I look at it, it's like wavy. Um, it's definitely like brighter than it looks on here. Uh, brighter than it looks on here in real life. And then, where is it? I've got this remote, so, and you can control it from your phone as well. So, but this is good because if I'm just in bed, I can just fucking turn it off, you know? Yeah. Change the color of it, you can make it flash. You can make it go slow, whatever you want, I don't know. But then it'll be cool for the um, the auto thing and the flash thing for like a makeup video or something, I don't know. Sorry, I realized I was filming that like a fucking idiot. But this is it with the light though, it's just cute, it's just cute. Fits with the craziness of the room, I think. And then, yeah, it just does, whoa, oh. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, flash warning. Yeah, you get the gist. I like it. However, this could definitely not light up your face the way that the other one, other lights could. For say if you wanted to film a makeup video or do your fucking skincare. But, oh well, that's what this is for. I suppose, Jesus Christ, well, that's really scary. Wow. Anyway, from Cheshire Oaks, what I got is, wow, I should film with this lighting all the time. Um, Right, I decided on the ones with the platform because I think then I can wear them outside the house whereas the other ones were just strictly slippers I don't think you can wear them out well I, I would but I don't think they'd look as good out of the house however it was weird because the kids ones fit me better and I'm a size either three or a four depending on the shoe um these are a five now I know there's a lot of fluff in them so you know that will flatten down eventually but it's just a bit weird I mean there was only one pair left they were clearance, so it was literally, I didn't even get box. I love a box, but I suppose I don't need any more boxes. But yeah, so I don't know why. Hope my feet aren't growing. But got these, they were £40. There were so many good deals in Ugg. Like, my fluff, yeah, sliders. The only Ugg I've ever got, actually. My old, yeah, my only Ugg. Um, they were, I bought them for 100 quid. They were selling them for £30 in there. Like, I know they've been out a while and maybe they're dropping them, but it's cheap. Anyway, from Levi's, there was a little deal on where it was buy something, get, buy something, get the next thing half price. I don't know if there's an easier way of saying that, but I've got this little crop top. I know it looks tiny, but I've got the smallest one because I like it to be tight to hold my boobs in place because otherwise I've just got Madonna pointy boobs and I just don't care for that. Um, yeah, cute. And then I saw this show you this maybe i think i already told you all this i already told you all this i got this top for jake and i was thinking i'm just gonna give it him no, not that he deserves it uh just a little treat because i'm um, a really nice girlfriend but i realize it's valentine's day soon so i might just shuffle that in as a present 
Then I got the docks. I got the docks. I definitely know that these won't be up everyone's street because they are, they are fucking weird looking to be honest, but I just think they're dead cute. Uh, yeah, and I've always kind of wanted a full cream dock and I just thought, why not? I've got a pair of Pascals anyway. It's like a, a soft leather as opposed to the other thicker ones. Um, and I always loved them. So yeah, sold and they were 60 pound. Like I paid 150 for my black ones, as you can see over there. Um, so it said 150 and then that was crossed out and then it was, where's it say? Yeah, 150, then 99, then 60. That is like, it's less than half price. That's mad. That's mad. So there is still a few pairs if you want to be quick. If I get this vlog up on time, I will. And you want to get Nan's Cheshire Oaks if you're a size 3, 4, 5 or 6. They're the only sizes yet left. Not many, but she said, I think she said that what she said, they're fragmented or something like that. So basically, there's just not even enough left to put on the shelf really. So you got to be quick. I think I got a good bag in there. I was on the shelf, uh, the shelf. <laughs> These were on the shelf. I was on the fence about them but i just thought you know what docks are always going to be cool and i like how quirky these are uh and they're a fucking bargain even if i don't want these next week i could sell these for i think more than what i paid for them yeah oh and what else did i get last thing was when we went into denby to look for my mom's plates which they didn't have sorry mom uh they had these candles and they smell amazing. They were pretty expensive. Like, it's small, this. It's small, but it was £10. But I just know because it's from Denby, it's going to be good quality and it's going to smell great. Like, sorry, not great. It's going to smell strong when you're in the room. So I got this because it smells just like Tom Ford Black Orchid. Oh, it's fucking sexy. I don't actually know what it is. Jasmine and patchouli. Yeah, so I got one for me and one for Jake. So maybe I'll give that in for Valentine's Day as well. Who knows? I did just get him as a tree, but oh my god, I can't wait to light it. Do I be ceremonial about it or do I just do it now? <laughs> I couldn't wait. Life's life's not about li waiting. Light the candle, eat the chocolate, go for the run. I don't know what else you should do. Uh. I'll let you know if it's a strong smeller or it's a waste of money. This bedding is so not dry. It's like nearly dry, but it's just a little bit damp. Fucking terrible. I'll put the heated blanket on though. I'm just gonna have to deal with it. Because it just didn't look neat without the thing on. Anyway, I think I... Oh God, do I order my smiley lamp? Is it getting too crazy in here, this room now? I don't know. Here, this room. Hmm. <laughs> it's quite expensive, that smiley lamp. For a lamp that's a smiley face. But I mean, I think if I need to order it, I need to order it now. Every time I eat that pizza, it gives me a lot of pain in my stomach. Well, it only started. It, no, it didn't like originally, but then it, then it began. Uh, so I've got a lot of pain in my stomach. I put the heated blanket on, on full whack so I can like rest my stomach on it but it soothes a little bit but it still it still hurts once this passes i'll get up and do something anyway whilst i'm stuck in bed uh the tiffany collaboration with nike disappointing what the fuck are them shoes why did we not do dunks fucking air force who still wears air force well, I suppose they'll cry on some people, but I'm not interested. I'm not interested. <sighs> well, it's not just me that thinks that. Everyone hates them, don't they? Well, not everyone, but there's been a bit of an uh, uproar. Because they're just very disappointing. It's just a black shoe with a, a blue Tiffany coloured tick. Okay, I'm up to date with all my editing. It's half twelve. It's time to get up, grin and bear it. I refuse to take a paracetamol because I just feel like I don't, I don't need it. So I'm, I don't, shouldn't take too many. That's vintage posted. I hate, why 
why do they have a time limit? It's so, like, I get why they have a time limit, but it's so annoying. Sometimes I need longer than a week to post something. I'm sorry. I'm busy. I hate the stress. Last day to send the parcel. Oh, but fuck off. It's my parcel. It's my vintage. <laughs> He's falling asleep on him right now. I just really can't be asked doing anything. This is just so fucking annoying. What day is it? Friday. This has been uploading for four days. That's how bad my signal is. Four days. And it's only on... Oh, I just can't be asked. What is the point in me editing these vlogs actually on time if they're not even going to go up on time? It's like the world doesn't want me to have them up on time. Okay, so seeing as I'm procrastinating, I thought it would, I would see what it would look like when I covered this table in stickers. First of all, I wanted to see if I had enough stickers, which I definitely think I'd do. But yeah, just an idea of what it would look like. Obviously, I don't think I've sticked this many super green ones down because they're just, they're just like taking over. I didn't even know I had that many. I didn't know I had this many stickers, to be honest. And there's so many super green ones that I didn't know I had. Like, what, like, honestly, some that I've never even seen before, like this one, how could I not? I don't know. I remember receiving that. I've got this fucking second one. Jake really wants that. Fuck Jake, it's mine. You should have ordered some of that. Stupid bitch. Yeah. Um, I just don't know. Does it look? Obviously, it looks crazy. Obviously, but I just wanted it to look kind of cool. It's gonna have a layer of glass on top of it. I'm also worried. I'm kind of worried it won't work because, well, it's not gonna be very flat, is it? Oh, I don't know. If anyone's got any suggestions or thoughts please let me know because i'm very stuck about this i don't want to waste all these stickers because i'm so sentimental about things and i already feel i already never wanted to use them but i just think do you know what the fucking stickers jenna they were born to be stuck so and if you really 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 miss them that much and it was that terrible you could buy them again right i just don't know I don't know whether to take the plunge and do it. Also stick something else underneath it. I know I could do like a layer of vinyl, but I just thought this would be cool because the room's wacky and I thought it'd look cool under the glass and... Mm, oh, I don't, I really don't know, I really don't know, I really don't know. Just really can't be asked with makeup today. It's quarter to five, but I'm, I'm not, not doing it, I'm doing it. So I'm just doing a easy look i'm gonna do olivia rodrigo makeup you know this sour album cover when she's got all the stickers on her face i bought these stickers maybe like a year ago to do that makeup look and i've just never done it but i'm going to do to make it oh fuck i just realized i don't have a pink wall because she has we'll make it work somehow yeah she has a purple background to match the purple theme, so I should have a pink background to match the pink theme. I mean, that is pinky, but I want a full sheet like she has. <sighs> yeah, so I'm gonna do like a Valentine's version to make it different, uh, just like all pink and red stickers and hearts and stuff, but still, I'll do Rodrigo. But then when she sticks the tongue out, instead of saying sour, it will say love. I'm gonna have to make sure I do it the right way around now. 10 past five, I still haven't begun, but I have just ordered my smiley lamp. I got the medium size because I think, well, the XL one's huge, so that would just look stupid, and then the tiny one's too small. So, yeah, I think it'll look good. Uh, I got 10% off on Urban Outfitters, Urban Outfitters, and free delivery because it was over £40. So, yeah, good day. I hope it comes ASAP. Oh my god, I'm done. I literally don't know how I do this every time, but it's half nine. I'm not. It's like I like it, you know, there's not really much to like, it's just a simple look. Uh, I do like it, I just, the lighting, I feel like the lighting's a bit shit, I don't know, there's something about the video that I just really don't like. I just feel like the lighting, but I don't know, maybe the makeup looks shit, but I mean, I don't know what it is. Uh, yeah, but this is my take on Sour, the album cover. Yeah, it's cute. I like this whole pink. Uh, I really want to 
to take it off now though, it's kind of pissing me off. I've really struggled taking these videos. I've just not felt like they look good, so I don't feel great. Just need to get a picture and then I'm going to wash it off and I need to make tea. I need my dad. So oh, hi. Hello, oh, this is up. What do you think, pal? I think it's very tasty, I love it. Well, you were slagging me off the whole time I was making it. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that makeup look. It really... I don't know. I'm going to look at the pictures. I'll see how I feel. But it's never good when you start rushing it and then it's just... Oh, God. Uh, I feel exhausted now and I shouldn't because that was like... Not an intense makeup, but uh, I've still got glue stuck to my forehead. Baking Sally in bed on a Sunday. <sighs> it's not good. I need to, uh, I need a PT. I feel like that's the only way that'll force me, guilt trip me into eating better and going to the gym. It's Saturday. I thought it was fucking Sunday, you mad. I can't believe this. Five days this talk, and it's still not done because it's still processing. Five fucking days. Right, well that's just great. That's great. Five days to upload and then it, it just doesn't upload. Right, okay. I have like 24,000 pictures and videos on my phone. So I've just been, no, I didn't get you a lead. You've got a lead in your pocket, have you not? Why would I have got your lead out if you didn't ask me to get your lead out? So I've just been deleting them all day, like a hermit in uh, bed. So, now I've still got loads more to go. I've still got glue on my face from yesterday. So I'm attending my father on a dog walk because I need the fresh air. And I was looking back at pictures and I looked really chubby on some of them. And I was like, oh my God. I need some exercise. Exercise. Are you for real? My dad's going in the pub and he doesn't want to go any further without him. Carter, come on, it's a dog walk. You're telling me you want to go in the pub? Carter. Not bad. Carter. Are you happy now? Dog shit dunks. Great. Fucking great. I had to put bleach on them because even after I washed them, they still smell like dog shit. Brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, I am going to delete a thousand pictures, then I'm allowed to have my tea. Five minutes! Woo! Go on, lads! Done! I don't know what sadder Jack and Rose are them for. Bloody music men. Oh, all this guy and his shit. Oh, or him and his clock. Michael Bublé. Oh, God, it's all too much. Oh, heck. Oh, bloody hell. In every way that a person can be saved. I'm not doing that shit again. Not one more time. Oh, God. That's, why would you want to be that sad? Oh, God. Never again. Oh, and the end part when... Oh, and it's like... She's just died. Can't, where, did she die? I don't know. Oh, when... She has that bloody dream and it's like at the end when they're all on the ship and they're all alive and she meets him again. Oh, oh I did not need this. No. Morning. It's actually Sunday today. I've been deleting pictures all morning. It's a drab job, but it needs doing. I've got it down from 18,000 to 13,000. So that's quite a lot, but I'm still going. I'm still going. I, I want it down to like, this is a bit of an ask, but maybe like 4,000? Shit, I don't know. The, but I put it on my story and someone replied saying that there's a way that they do it. And they'll just type in the date. So like today, God, I don't even know what day it is. Let's say it's the 5th of Feb. I would type in the 5th of Feb into my photo, photos. And then 
just go through them. So it'll bring up 5th of Feb 2023, 2022, 2021. It'll bring up all the 5th of Febs. That way you can do it day by day and it's not too much, you know? So I, well, I did the full month of Feb because I thought I've got a lot of pictures I need this done. But I'm going to do, tomorrow I'm going to do the full month of, you know, what is it next? Is it March next? Oh my God. No, is it? January, February, March, April, May. Oh my God. Whoa. That's crazy. Yeah. So that's a nice little way to do it if you've got too many fucking pictures like me. Nice and tidy. I've misted all my plants. I've moved them over there so you can get a bit more light. I have, what's it called? Crep protected my new dunks and also my Uggs. Uh, what else have I done? Just need to vac when I get home. And then also, this video is nearly done. So hopefully I can upload the next one tonight. Look at the state. It doesn't actually look dirty in real life, that I must say. Now we're going to the gym. Look at that. Absolute tomato head. These are wet. These are wet. It's disgusting. I should probably wash them. I, well, you can actually take them off, you know. Watch this. Wow! Who'd have thought? Really clever. So, I'm going to give them a mark down. Because I thought, fuck, when I got them, these are going to be stained with fake tan. But you can just take it off and clean it. Brilliant. Um, oh, fucking yeah. hell. It's funny how making yourself feel like you're going to die is good for your body. My chest was so tight and I was like <gasps> But I was like, do you know what? Your body's gonna love you later. Anyway, I've taken the plunge because I've decided, well, I know that I have absolutely no self-discipline, no willpower, nothing. And I need something to force I've always wanted to lose weight and I've never successfully done it, so I need something to force me. So and I thought paying forty pounds a month for the gym would have forced me, but it, it still hasn't, so <laughs> If I'm not taking full advantage of this gym membership, then I'm just wasting my money and I do not like to waste money. So, I'm gonna do PT. I've messaged Danielle. If you don't know Danielle, she's great. She's a great PT. Well, I don't know that she's a great PT because I've never had her as a PT, but I know that she's a great PT because I just know. So, I'm gonna do PT with Danielle. And if that doesn't, make me do it then it will i just need someone with knowledge you know because i don't know what i'm doing daniel knows everything so yeah we're doing it we're doing it there she is why does it feel like so much? i can love it nothing like a bit of collagen on a sunday ah oh, stunning stunning it's like tomato soup it's actually pink in real life. I hate how the camera doesn't capture it. I have had this mask on. I've had this mask on for literally longer than an hour. I'd be surprised if there's any moisture left on it for me to rub into my skin. <laughs> oh my God, it's actually so dry. Oh well, I hope my skin's benefited. Shit. Oh shit, it's actually dry to my hair. Anyway, my first PT session. PT session. PT session is booked in. So I'm starting on Wednesday at 7. 7 in the morning. Is she trying to kill me? Maybe. We know I'm not a morning person, so it might be a good thing, really. It might get me to go to bed a bit earlier. So it's only one day a week, isn't it? Well, I'm doing two days a week. But the one, uh, the one on Friday is at 10, so that's all right. It's a bit of me, that. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, I'm already recording. Do you know what I've realised, right? I like my face tan. I do. I love all my money made tan. My spirit speed, the drops, the foam, everything. I never want to change it. But my on my face, because I have to keep it up often, because obviously you take makeup off and on it, you know, face tan comes off fast. But I realised it goes kind of like, not blotchy, but it does just look kind of speckled and a little bit uneven. And I've realised why. It's because I don't exfoliate my face. Like, obviously, I'll do my toner, which is, um, 
that will do some sort of exfoliation and then you know take my makeup off and that but i don't actually yeah exfoliate my skin and i realized that is why so i've started doing that now so and i can tell actually my skin looks a lot more even looking i've only been doing it for like two days i know you're not supposed to exfoliate every day i'm not going to do it but yeah just realized it's gonna make my face tan look a lot better i hope so anyway i'm trialing it this week Covering calm. Time's all done, ready for a fresh week tomorrow. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow as well, which I'm very glad about because I just keep leaving it until it's like really disgusting. Uh, I don't know, I just really don't like my hair at the minute. I'm waiting to get it done. And then, you know when you've just got it in your head that you want something done and then you, you hate it up to the point when you get it. Like, I'm just, I need my hair done. I don't. I don't relate to you anymore. Yeah, so hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. New extensions soon. Do you know what I was thinking before as well? Because I was watching Glow Up whilst I was doing my tan. And having gone through that audition, like, sign-up process, that was long and I didn't even get the full way. Like, how annoying and gutting it must be to go through all that, go through like applying and then waiting to see if you got it and then the interview and then waiting to see if you got it and then the next interview and waiting to see if you got it and the audition and the audition and the interview to finally get on the show, to get kicked out in the first episode, that would be so good, so good because I felt like I ran a fucking marathon and I only got, I only got to the audition, yeah. I was just thinking about it. I just saw the first person go out. I was like, they didn't deserve to go out. Uh, yeah, and I just thought that. Like, that's, that's a bummer. That is a bummer. But I mean, yeah, it's literally, it's like winning the competition. Just getting on the competition. Maybe one day. Anyway, my bros. It is the end of a week. Uh, end of the week. I hope you've all had a really nice week. I've had a quite a nice week, you know. I feel like I'm achieving stuff this year. We are determined. Do you know what I don't like about fake tan night? It means I can't cuddle Kitty. It's not like an absolute little freak, but I understand why these squishmallows are so popular because oh, I just love hugging her. She's so soft and so squishy. God damn it. Anyway, I hope everyone's had a really nice week and I'll see you next week for my, oh, my first PT session next week.